Hi, everybody. If you've been thinking about purchasing a posture support to help you at your desk or at your job when you have to sit there for hours on end, today I'm going to go through what to look for in a posture support, how to use it, and definitely what to avoid. My name is Dr. Lena Shulman. I am a chiropractor and a posture specialist who's been practicing for over 28 years. And I've got a few things to show you here. So obviously we can't go through every posture support on the market, but I'm gonna show you the basics of the good ones and the not so good ones. And I'll link some of my favorites below. So first and foremost, why do we use a posture support? So we use this posture support if you're finding that you just have to sit at your desk for long periods of time and you want to break up the amount of time that you actually have to think about good posture. So you're only going to use this for about 20 minutes at a time. You can do 20 minutes in the morning, 20 minutes in the afternoon of your shift, but this is definitely not something that you want to wear all day. It's going to hold your body in a different position than you might naturally hold it in. And so it can really do some damage if you're wearing it all day long. Your muscles are going to get much weaker and the wrong muscles are going to start to get sore. So we love posture supports, but again, just for short periods of time, unless you've injured yourself and your health professional has told you otherwise. So what do we want in a posture support? Well, when you put a posture support on, what you don't want to do is wear it like a knapsack. So in other words, you don't want the straps of the posture support to be in here, inside the shoulders. What the posture support is really wants to do is it wants to keep your chest wide. So don't think of it as wanting to pull your shoulder blades back together so much as keeping your shoulders from rolling forward. So we want the posture support to hit us right out here so it can hold this wide because when I hold this why I'm less likely to bring my head forward and I can't round my upper back too much and cause all those detrimental effects that you get from sitting at your desk hunched over all day. So because of that, this is one of the posture supports that I don't recommend. And the reason that I don't recommend it is that when you put this on, it's almost impossible to put it on and not have it sit really in tight. So let me get this on for you. You'll see that because of the shape of this posture support, it insists that I keep it very close into my chest area. It doesn't allow me to have it sit here comfortably. The shape of it will continue to pull it in because of the way it's pulling down my back. And so for that reason, we don't love this one. You wanna make sure that you can very comfortably wear this posture support just out in through this area. Again, I have these supports a little bit set obviously loose for me just so that I can put them on and off for the video. I'll show you how tight they should be by the end. The other really, really important reason we want to make sure we're standing in proper posture is because when you are in proper posture, you get 30% more oxygen. So anyone out there who's getting brain fog and fatigue and headaches and all of that sitting at their desk, one of the reasons for that is that when you're slouching, you are shutting down your ability to take deep breaths in your lungs. So because of that, we never ever want to buy a posture support that is also going to constrict our breathing. So many of these type of posture supports have this strap that's supposed to come around my ribs and do it up and through here. You can see immediately that is gonna close down the ability for my lower lungs to do their job for my lower ribs to expand properly. And one of the really important things we wanna to do to stay healthy is make sure that we're able to actually to breathe into those lower lungs. So no posture supports that are overly restrictive to your rib cage and don't allow you to take those full natural breaths. Now, what do I like in a posture support? So this is one of my favorites. We did, a, post, we did a, a review on one that's similar to this in 2020. Unfortunately, it's been sold out now in many sizes. So here's one that's very similar that we like. And what I love about this posture port is, this support is the shape, the simplicity of the posture support, and how easy it is to uh, affect how tight it is from the front. So I'm gonna show you. So all I'm gonna do, and it's very reasonably priced. Most of these are only about $20. So. As you can see, I've got this on. If I wanted to tighten it, all that I have to do is pull these straps from the front. So it's not something that I have to take off and on and off and on to get it to the right um, stability for me. You can see how easily I'm able to put it on the outside of my shoulders and through here. This is about the right, I don't think I have it even, but this is about the right 
amount of pulling that you want on a posture support. So you can see it's not yanking me back into proper posture. It's just holding me there very comfortably so that when I stand in proper posture, I almost don't even feel it's there. But certainly if I started to round forward, it would be a very good reminder to me, even just from a proprioceptive point of view, that I'm starting to slouch. So it would hold me in the right position. And the other reason that we love this posture support is that it comes with these handy dandy pieces that you can put in so that you don't have to worry too much about the rub marks. Sometimes when you wear this for a little bit, it starts to rub a little bit in the front and that can be quite uncomfortable, but certainly that these little pieces will help that a great deal. You can see how easy that was to take off and on and I didn't even undo the Velcro, but undoing the Velcro makes it even easier to put off and on. That posture support will also fit many, many different sizes. So if you have someone that you want to share your posture support with, I really recommend one like that where you can affect it from the front. It comes with padding. It sits very comfortably on the outside of your shoulders. And one last benefit I didn't mention about this one is look at how lovely and thick these straps are. You don't want something that's gonna to be too skinny like some of these are, because they're really gonna dig into one area rather than just gradually ensuring that they're putting enough pressure to keep those collarbones open and helping you feel your best. So if you, if you have questions about posture supports, just put them below and I'm really happy to take a look at any one that you're looking at on the market and let you know what I think of it, give you my opinion. If you got value in this video, We'd love it if you'd press like, because we love making these videos. And other than that, if you subscribe to our channel, we'd really appreciate it and have a wonderful day.